Salamat pagi, good morning guys, how are we doing? Right now we are in the city of Kuala Terengganu on Peninsula Malaysia's east coast. Now today we're going to go and try as much delicious local food as we can. Everything on the east coast looks so good. So I'm super excited. Bloody miserable day, as you can see. But let's go for it. You can see we've got the state flag. Terengganu state flag here. Oh, and I've just nearly slipped in my flip flops. But yeah, let's go. Alright, here we are. We've come for some nasi dagang. So let's have a look what's going on. Let's see if they've got the goods. It's like 8 am, so I think they should do. Let's see. Hello, salam again. Do you have nasi dagang? Hello. Satu nasi dagang. Huh? Oh. Oh. Perfect, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what comes. We've never had nasi dagang before, so I'll probably just wait for it to make it. I'm not gonna dive into the kitchen. But yeah, it should be good. Right, so we're eating nasi dagang, which we haven't tried yet, and it does look really good. It looks really interesting, so I'll just tell you what this is. We've got a pile of rice, which I think is actually a mix of your standard rice and a little bit of sticky rice. And then it comes with a side of this fish curry. So this is all like sauce, if you will. And then there's a little chilli in there as well, I'll show you that. Look at this bad boy. Oh, miss those. Yeah, so I think what we'll do is just scoop some of this over the top and give it a try. I'll try this curry on its own though as well. It does actually look quite good. Let's see what it's like. Oh wow, that's absolutely delicious. A little spicy, yeah, I like that. Mmm. Yeah, it's really good. Definitely taste that it is a fish curry. I don't know what fish it is, tuna or what. But yeah, I'll just throw some on. Look at this. Here we go then, first time trying Nasi Degang. Here on Malaysia's East Coast, let's get some fish first. Let's get a bit of everything, yeah? Do it the way we've got to do it. Let's get some of the rice with the um, delicious curry. Mm. Let's try the actual fish. That's well good. And then obviously, the chilli. Nice and spicy, I love that. Ooh, that's good. Need more than one of those. Mm. Rice is really nice, actually. It's really tasty. And that sauce, you don't need much of it. Mm. It's just a rich fish curry. It's actually really good. It looks so simple, it's probably one of the simplest dishes we've had. Mm. Just asked them, they've actually brought over a nice little extra bowl for us of a bit more sauce and two of these big, bad red boys. They look so good. Now we're talking, now we're cooking. It's well good, this. A big chunk of fish as well. I think it's tuna. Let's just try another big piece of it. Simple but delicious. Nice big meaty chunk of fish. The curry is delicious. I think it's only five ringgit. It's a big thumbs up. And I also forgot to mention the rice is cooked in coconut milk. Can confirm it's absolutely delicious. It's creamy. Mm. It's good stuff. The nasi dagang is that good, Lee, she's got a portion. And I think she's got a tail piece of fish. And it looks well good, doesn't it? Incredible. Let's try the rice one. Oh, well done. Mm. That's amazing. 
amazing. Incredible. Not unlike anything we've had actually. But it's not like heavy. I think it's a really light for me. Delicious. I did say it were a miserable day, didn't I? Take a look at this. We're stuck in here now, we'll just have to go back. <laughs> we'll have to work our way through the menu until it stops raining. While we wait for the rain to stop, we grab two curry pops, these little pastry puffs. It's two for a ringgit. One is ikan, one is fish, and the other is potato, which I think the word was ubi or something like that. It's a lucky bit. Which one are you getting, Leash? I'm gonna get this one. Maybe we can have half each. Oh, that's the potato, potato. Oh, yeah, you can see. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, let's have a look at this. Just a nice little snack. Ooh, oh, the fillings oh, fell out. Actually, I'm on side. I'll have the fish one first. Yeah. The rain's gone so today. The rain's terrible. Yeah, just a nice little snack. Look at that. Nice little pastry. And the rain's have started again. Really heavy. Mm. I mean, sometimes you can't go wrong with a little pastry. Especially being English. Mm. So, get to that camera, I'll see my face. I'm gonna smash the joint off. Looks alright, this too fair. Actually, not stale. I thought it was gonna be stale because it's just set in the cabinet. It's just self service, but. Does it come in the morning? I thought everything here quite fresh. Just potato and some nice spices. I don't know what, but it's good. Okay, two and half, right? Yes. Uh -huh. And tea or tea or one? Yeah. Two, two curry pap. Two curry pap. Okay, you're going to put the two and one curry pap. One fifty. Perfect. Sangat sedap. Sangat sedap. Lain kali datang lagi. Oh, terima kasih. Can I look at the rice? Huh? Can I look at the okay. rice? So I just want to show you the rice that we just had because I found out another secret about it. This is the nasi daging rice. Nasi. This is the nasi dagang rice. And inside, the lady told me there's actually onion, ginger. And I can't remember what else, but yeah. Just onion. What is in there? It is onion, ginger. Ginger, then go uh, santan, clapper. Uh, coconut, 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 onion, ginger. Uh, uh, ginger. Lepas tu kau kena ni eh ah pandu tahu nasi then kau nasi dulu tu that, that one is a soft one and on uh, original rice okay, okay, okay. uh, mix then steam okay thank you uh, so this much. one not okay only steam okay uh. it's delicious sit, sit up yeah so it's um it's like a sticky rice normal rice mix coconut milk ginger onion take the shallots and then look at that is that the, the I don't know what that is. Well, that looks well good, yeah. And I don't know what this is. She told me, but again, it's all new to us. Okay, then I'm going to say, lovely, yeah? Really nice people. And it's only five for the nasi bag hang, which is cracking price because it's well delicious. Yeah, really good little spot. I'll put the name in the description because I can't remember again. But yeah, it was really good, that actually. Really good. The rice was just fantastic, yeah. Coconut milk. Ginger and onion in it. Shallot. Mm. All right, then we've come to this little nasi kandar spot, and we've got an absolute serious plate of food. This weighs about a kilogram. It's ridiculous. Now, nasi kandar, our mate here tells us, is a Malay Indian fusion food, and we have seen them everywhere, but this is our first time eating it. So it's essentially just kind of like a, almost like a buffet. So they've got, they just pile the plate up with rice, and then you can get all types of various different curries, vegetables, and you name it, they've got eggs, they've got all kinds of stuff in there. Look at the size of this. It's ridiculous. So we've got, what is this, okra. okra. And then we have got these huge pieces of chicken in like a curry. We've got these, which I don't know what they are. Again, have you tried them, Leash? It's like pea, but it doesn't taste like pea. pea to me. What is this one, my friend? Malay uh, polier. Malay polier. Ah, okay. So I don't know what these are, but we've got those, and then we've got just a mountain of rice, a few different vegetable assortments, and then all this gravy, like all this sauce. So what they do is they get 
all the sauces, like all the curries, and they just absolutely flood the rice. So there's a mutton curry, beef curry, fish curry, and something else, and they just pour all that over the rice. I mean, this is well done, and this is 11.50 ringgit, so thank you, my friend. Yeah. And then we have got the syrup drink, just syrup and water. It's so sweet, but it's delicious. What is it? Is it rose syrup? Mm. Yeah, it's really good, nice and cold. So, let's get stuck into this. Tiny bit of syrup, but it was like the sugar was up to there, like the powdered sugar. Right, tells us the sugar levels in this syrup drink was literally up to here, like halfway. That is legendary. But it is delicious, I mean, there's no denying it. It's definitely not good for the teeth. So let's get stuck into this. I mean, I don't even know where to start. It looks well, but the chicken in, in here looks fantastic. We've got big pieces of chicken, look at that. Well, we'll back. It tastes like it's been doing the tandoor oven they've got at the front. Alright, let's get stuck in. It's a messy one. I'll tell you that, it's a messy one. I'll try and break a bit of everything off here. And try these curries. Oh god. That's good. That is really rich though. Those curries are really rich, yeah. I'll tell you what, delicious though. Really loving, again, the taste of the um, South Indian spices. Yeah, that's well good. Got all kinds in here. Let's try these ladies' fingers. Mm. And then this stuff. Let us know what this is. Mm. It's really tasty, I'll say that. Oh, it's well with that. Nice and fried, crispy. But this is a mammoth portion. And I don't know if I said it was 11.50 ringgit, which is like two pounds, two quid. I mean, you can't go wrong with that. This is going to fill you up for the next week. There's that much rice and curry on this plate. Let's try my chicken. It's like Shadow's Tondo chicken. And then Leash pretty much has the same plate, but she's got a few more veggies and she's got this huge chunk of chicken on the bone, that red chicken, and it's massive. It looks well good, look at that. So we'll try that meat now, we'll give that um, chicken meat a taste. Mix it with the rice. Mm. It's well good, but you've seen there's so much food here. There's so much rice as well. It's rich, it's delicious. I don't have anything more to say. It's well good. I'll tell you what, this plate of food absolutely destroys you. I don't know if it's just the food that's so rich or this bloody sugar bomb. But yeah, leash is like in a food form. I feel like I'm gonna die. I feel really awful because like, I hate leaving so much food, but I can't eat it. <laughs> it's so filling. Also, to see, we've got these little chilies in here, which are really tasty. Mmm. They are delicious. Yeah, it's a serious meal, this. Mmm. Not for the fact oh. This will fill you up all day. And night. And tomorrow. And to next day, and <laughs> Thank you very much. Tell me a safe. Thank you so much. So I'll just show you as we walk out all the different foods you got. So here are all the curries. I think that's the beef, fish, mutton. We've got the eggs. I don't know what this is, and then yeah, it's just more food. Probably your chicken and your meats, prawns, they look quite good, don't they? 
remember veg at the top and hello and they've got chilies and I'm absolutely devastated that I didn't see them. I feel like crying. What is this? Is this biryani? I have no idea. Maybe. Is this biryani? Biryani. Oh wow. What um dagging? I am chicken biryani. Oh wow, that looks good. Can I make a sip? Bangladesh, Dhaka. Ah, nice to meet you. This is hot, but it looks so good, doesn't it? Oh, I can't get my camera in there. That looks so good. Okay, goodbye. You've never seen plates of food that big in your entire life, I swear. Nasi Kandar and Biryani. Biryani Hyderabad. Ah, it's a Hyderabad biryani spot. Ali Spices. Interesting stuff. You can see he's got a bit of the um, tandoor chicken hanging there. That was well good, but I'll tell you what, I need to go and have a sleep. I feel like I'm going to die. <laughs> so good though. <laughs> right, our friend, Tom, who cut my hair today, yeah. has just brought us some Kerapok liqueur, which is an absolute Terengganu specialty. Yeah. yeah. How kind don't, is that? Don't forget to dip in the sauce. Yeah. To dip yeah. it in the sauce. So they look fish. so good. So it's fish. It's fish and the sauce is like the Chili, but a chili dip. I'm not sure. For me, it's not, not that spicy. No. no. Yeah. Oh, thank you so much. Then I can say. See you. <laughs> See you later. Yeah, thank you so much. How kind <laughs> is that? He's just come home from work. He's just texted me. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. Good luck, my friend. Goodbye. <laughs> Alicia. Alicia. Ellis. Alicia and Ellis. Yeah, yes. similar. Lovely to meet you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Look at his bike. That is so kind, yeah. So I, I walked up to him the other day saying I'm going to come and get my hair cut. And then he's just um, sexy saying I'm on my way home from work. I'm going to bring you some Kerapok liqueur, which is literally, we're about to go out tonight to try these. So that's amazing. It's nice because he said he wants us to try the real ones, not, not, yeah, yeah, yeah. not rubbish ones. He said he wants us to try the best. So what this is, he just told us, it is, it's like a fish sausage, we'll call it. So it is, how would you call it? Like minced fish mixed with sago flour, which is a flour from a palm tree, I'm pretty sure, in this region of the world. So we give them a big dip in the sauce. Cheers, they look good, don't they? they like. So good. I think these are the fried ones. You get them fried or boiled. Oh, I'm dropping the sauce look everywhere. Look how nice that is. It's well canned, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. it's so lovely. It was absolutely lovely chap as well. They were just had a very good time. <laughs> Proper got along with him. Right, let's try this. You know what? I did not expect it to taste like that whatsoever, but that is well good. It is fried. The middle is soft, but the outside a little bit crispy. And that chili dip. It's really good, Pat. It's really good. Let's try and give it another dip. Oh! Mm. It's actually delicious. It's oh, not yeah. super fishy. No. But it tastes like like fresh fish. It doesn't taste like rubbish, does it? You can use a mix of different fish. Well, I'm guessing it's just dependent on who's making them. That sauce is really delicious too. You can actually see the chilli in the sauce. It's that little red chilli. Yeah. <laughs> I just can't believe how nice that is. How thoughtful to, to be home from, go on the way home from work and think, oh, I wonder if uh, they want some of these. They said they wanted to try them. So we're having a proper chat while we have, the whole time we're having a haircut, we were just talking about like mm -hmm. food in Malaysia. They're well good, but like, look at them. They look so interesting. They're heavy too. Mm. Like, they're not light, it's a heavy tonight. It's got a bit of weight to them. These are. Oh, I forgot what I'm saying. Yeah, these are just like an absolute Terengganu classic. He said people come. He said it's like, if you don't do. If you don't eat these in Terengganu, have you even been to Terengganu? He didn't say that, I've just said that. But he said it's like an essential. Like you see them when we drove into Terengganu State, they're all over the side of the road. We're good even without the sauce. It tastes really fresh. One last step. <coughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Well good. Well good. I didn't think they were going to be that good, but 
Delicious. Really good. A little, little bit spongy. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Well, well, well. <laughs> Look who's showed up. Look who's smelt the catapult liqueur. Mm. You've sniffed them, haven't you? <laughs> yeah. What man, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, the sauce is fantastic. It's like a proper homemade sauce. Really impressed, like. It's like, you can get every now and then like a bite with the actual chili skin on it's well good. All right. So kind. Tun is an absolute legend. How nice is that? Just got to send us a gift. Well nice. Malaysian people. They're well nice. Eh? On the east coast, everyone's bloody lovely. Right, we've come to the Terengganu riverfront area. Well, there's usually a bit of a night market going on every day, but because it's been raining so hard all day, I think there's hardly been on here. I mean, look how miserable it looks. I don't blame them for not coming in. Unless they just have like one day off a week, maybe that's the thing, but. So we'll just see if there's anything we can grab while we're here. Yeah, the weather is terrible. You can see it's gonna throw it down soon. We found something here, Bubur Ayam Powder. I don't know what this is, but it looks interesting. Like a big mix of ingredients. Almost looks like um, some of the dishes we eat in Thailand. We'll have a look. Okay, one. Uh, is this? 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 Durian Belanda drink. Looks well good. Better be good. I had this one the other day, the vanilla blue. Which, oh, it's got ice cream in. Oh, wow, this one's so good. We had this the other day. But we'll try the durian today. <laughs> yeah, just one second. How much is water? Oh! Yeah. It's durian Belanda, it's not yeah. durian, it's soursop. Ah, soursop, oh, yeah, soursop. Oh, soursop. He's not, not durian. Oh, I thought it was durian. No, it's not durian, it's durian. Okay, it'll still be nice. It's soursop. We had this in Colombia, soursop. Oh, yeah. On the way back, we'll get the vanilla blue just to show you. It's really beautiful. Okay, there I'm going So this, soursop juice, is bloody well good. So fresh, it's really tasty. Because we're early on in the night, they've not been watered down yet, so it's well good. Three ringgit, proper, delicious. That can't believe I thought it was durian. Durian Belanda, sour salt. I think we might walk down here again, grab some food, walk down here again. I'll just show you all those drinks they've got, and then we'll get the blue one because it makes me happy. While we're in this little market, I'm just going to show you the Kerapok liqueur because there's a stand that is making them fresh. So we've actually just grabbed some more because they're so delicious, but he's frying them fresh here. As you can see, it's super hot. Don't want to get too close. And they have two different types. They have one that is boiled and then fried and one that is just fried. So we're going to try them both and then they're making them fresh here. So they've got the, the flour. I think that's the sago flour. It is sago flour? Sago. And where is that? Ikan? <laughs> Ikan. And then he just rolls them out. Oh wow. Okay. Then I can say, I can say. Yeah. They're a bit shy, but I just wanted to show you that because it's really cool because they're literally just mixing and then rolling and then frying. Really cool little operation. It's super busy. Every time we walk past here, there's been so many people queued up. Well, we've only just spent five ringgit. We've got loads. Oh, yeah. Two full <laughs> I think we made a mess of the order because we actually ordered. And how, what did we say? We said we wanted... I said five and six. Oh, we told him the amount of pieces we wanted, but he thought we meant ringgit's worth. So we made a bit of a hollow blue, but let's go and try them and see, see the difference. We found a nice little spot just behind the market with a view of the fishing boats, a few fishermen kicking around. So we're just going to try these Kerapok liqueur because they're so good. We knew when our mate gave us some earlier, we had to come for a second helping. So this is the... is this the... This is the boiled then fried ones. And then Leisha will get one of the other ones out here. And these are just fried. So they look different, don't they? These are bigger for a start. They have the expand when they boil them. Yeah, they look so different. Ooh. How does that one feel? This one feels like the one we had before. And then what's this, this one, one like? This one feels like the one we had before, I think. Quite airy. Ooh, I'm just going to try this one first. Yeah. Let's give it a dip into the chilli. Oh, there we go. 
the chilli sauce looks a bit thinner. It's not coated it like the one earlier did. Hmm. That's very airy. It's still quite delicious, but the ones before were really good. Mm. What's that? Mm. So they're like crispier on the outside, and they have like, you probably see that like dust. It's like flour, that flour that they've rolled it in makes the edge super crispy. Really fluffy in the middle. But yeah, they're like floury almost when you bite yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're as, they're as fresh as it gets as well because they, as soon as they came out there, there's a big queue. They've been bought instantly and then everyone is just waiting for the next batch. So let's just try this one. Let's try it uh, without the sauce. They're just continuously making frying, mm. making frying. This one's more expensive and I like this one more. Crunchy on the outside but it's like soft and doughy on the inside. Let's go dip in the sauce. Oh! Okay. Sauce is thin a lot. Oh, that's better. These ones? Yeah. Expensive? Yeah. There's a reason. I'm more expensive though. There we go. Yeah, sauce is definitely thinner than before. And it doesn't seem to be those big chunks of chilli in, but... It's still delicious nonetheless. But again, big up to Tun from East Coast Barbers for bringing us the best liqueur in Terengganu. That sauce was really good. This sauce isn't as good as that. Still good, but the other ones were phenomenal. Yeah, so for the cheap ones, it was five for one ringgit, and the other ones were two for one ringgit. So these are a lot cheaper. It looks like bread. It looks like a um, baguette. So they're really cheap, tasty. And they just taste like flour and fish which is what it is. There we go, that'll be it. Thanks so much for watching. We've had so much delicious food here in Kuala Terengganu. I'll tell you what, Malaysia is a foodie country, it's so good. You can just chat to all the locals. Everybody loves food, there's a big food culture, so everyone recommends us like good places to eat, foods to eat, and it's just really good. Yeah, there's so many unique dishes everywhere we go. Well good. I tell you what, the east coast of Malaysia has some incredible food. And I've just spotted these little guys here. Hello, these little kittens. We'll end it on you, eh? Do you want to say um, goodbye to all the viewers? Say thanks for watching. Go on, tell everyone. Oh, beep. Cute little kittens. There's another one here. Hello. Abba, Abba. Right, nice one for watching.